What's up guys? In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to create a PDF portfolio using Adobe Acrobat. So a PDF uh, portfolio is a package that encompasses or uh, houses different uh, file documents into uh, uh, one container. So let me open up uh, Adobe Acrobat. And then uh, we have these tools here. So the tool that you need is uh, create PDF, but you can as well go to tools, uh, create, uh, click on tools. So you can click here or you can also find it on the, on the right hand side bar. But uh, let me just click that, click on the create uh, PDF and then uh, so under this create PDF from any format, go to multiple files and choose the third uh, option that says create PDF portfolio and then click next. So here you have uh, uh, this uh, dialog window for adding uh, the files. So you can either uh, click on add file, then uh, select one, navigate to the location of your, where your files are located. And then you can decide to choose uh, one by one, select uh, select the first one, then press shift, uh, click the last one, and then uh, click open to add. But you can also uh, click on, on add folders, and then select the folder that contains all your files. It's going to add uh, all the files that are contained in that particular folder. So you click uh, select folder, and you can see all the files have been added and from uh, this point you can decide to to rearrange all the documents in a manner that uh, in an order that you want so let's say let's say that you want you want these all uh, the photos to be uh, the last ones so i'll add this here and uh, so you can see now we have all the all the photos uh, as the last ones and then i want uh the, this pdf to be this first one and uh, they were followed by what documents so what documents should be second one then uh, followed by excel i can also add that one there so uh at the, at the top right uh, corner of this, you can switch also to uh, list, you can switch to list view. Uh, and this way you can see uh, the, your files clearly. Uh, you can toggle in between the two. So from here now you, cl you click on create. And you can see all the files being created or being or the the all the folders are being added into one portfolio and automatically you can now see uh, the files have been added into one package without uh, converting them into a pdf uh, so uh, you can also uh, add a folder let's say i want to add a folder for pdf let's say i want a pdf uh, Docs, click enter. Now, let me just drag it at the top here so that I, it can become easy to drag all the uh, PDF documents. So I'm going to click those and drag into this one uh, folder. So if I click on that, you can see that uh, the folders, uh, the PDF are in one folder. And uh, if I go back, I can create another one for uh, say word. Say uh, call it word documents, and then click OK. Uh, I can drag, click, and drag that somewhere there, and then I want it at this point here. So I can click that and. Uh, click the next one so click the first one then press down control click the second one and then drag inside that folder 
so all those word documents are going to be are going to be uh, put inside this uh, document and uh, if i want now to open this in word you can just select one that you, you want to to view and you can open up in a in a word document so just open up so you can see uh, if you want that if you want to open that particular document in a in word you can that's how you can do that let me close it down uh, now that we have uh, this portfolio let me show you how to save you want, if you want to save go to files and then uh, uh, instead of clicking on this save portfolio or save us just click on a PDF for portfolio and uh, say you want to save it uh, I want to save it let's give it uh let me save it on the desktop and say let's let's give it a a, a specific name like uh documents pdf portfolio like that and click save so now it's saved we can close down and you can see now we have our, our portfolio here if you double click on it it's going to open up uh, this portfolio so uh, that's it for this tutorial and uh, see you in the next one.